When we consider Jesus, we see a man that had developed such an understanding of the things that were written before time, of the law and the prophets, that he knew the exact path that his heavenly father wanted him to take. But perhaps in contrast to Jesus, if you've ever been reading through a new passage in the Bible, you might have experienced the opposite, that you're not quite sure exactly what it means. So what do we do then? Do we pray for more understanding? First, we should briefly address another question you might be having. Why do some parts of the Bible seem so hard to understand? King Solomon provides us with an answer in the Proverbs when he writes, It is the glory of God to conceal things, but the glory of kings to search things out. In other words, God delights in those who invest time and effort in order to understand his message. So, should part of that search include praying for more wisdom and understanding? The answer is a definitive yes. James, the half-brother of Jesus, writes in his epistle, If any of you lacks wisdom, let him ask God, who gives generously to all without reproach, and it will be given him. However, we can't stop there. If we consider our relationship with God, prayer is us talking to God, and reading the Bible is God speaking to us. So if we ask God for wisdom, we need to read the Bible in order to hear his response. Another proverb confirms this when it says that our prayers, our requests to God, will be an abomination if we turn away our ears from hearing his law from reading the Bible. So, next time you're having trouble understanding that tricky Bible passage, or maybe next time you're in need of some guidance in your life, first, pray to God to ask for more understanding, and then continue to read his word to find those answers.